two at five, President Donald Trump may be heading back to Mobile for some 11th hour campaigning in the U.S. Senate race. CNN is reporting this trip, the president will stump for Tommy Tuberville in Jeff Sessions' own backyard. We have team coverage tonight. NBC 15's Corey Pippen is in Bruton, where Sessions will speak to the Scambia County GOP in about an hour. We begin first with NBC 15's Rachel Wilkerson, who's at Ladd Peebles Stadium, where the president is expected to appear July 11th. Rachel? Andrea, while CNN and Brett Bart are reporting that President Trump will make a campaign stop here, people who should be in the know say they are left in the dark. CNN White House correspondent Caitlin Collins posted on social media President Trump is expected to travel to Mobile next month for a rally supporting Tommy Tuberville. A Breitbart report says the rally is expected to be at Ladd Peebles Stadium Saturday, July 11th. That's the same place Jeff Sessions pledged his support for Mr. Trump in 2015. A crowd estimated at more than 20,000 people attended that rally five years ago. Do something fast. You can do something fast. A month after beating Hillary Clinton, President elect Trump came back to Mobile to thank the city and Jeff Sessions for their support. Now, after a very public breakup with Sessions, President Trump is backing Tommy Tuberville. In fact, just last week, Tuberville joined Mr. Trump on Air Force One during a trip to Texas. If the reports are true, city officials will once again prep Ladd Peebles Stadium with a focus on security and managing transportation issues around the stadium. If the president is coming, not everyone is in the loop. We reached out to the mayor's office and the police department. Neither has been made aware of a visit. The chairman of the Alabama Republican Party, Terry Lathan, also told us she doesn't have confirmation from the Trump campaign of a possible visit to Mobile. And lastly, the Tuberville campaign is not saying a word 26 days away from the reported rally. Ladd also confirmed the stadium has not been booked at this time. Reporting live in Mobile, Rachel Wilkerson, NBC 15 News. Rachel, thank you. Just a few weeks ago, President Trump took to his favorite social media outlet, Twitter, to write about his former attorney general. In those tweets, he wrote in part, quote, you should drop out of the race and Coach Tuberville will be a great senator.